All right, what are we doing, TJ? We're actually we're going to an art gallery right now for the Do What You Love artist. He's a really cool guy, big in the crypto scene, makes some great art that just says do what you love, clearly. Uh, looking for some stuff for the house and maybe for the new building. So we'll see what we can find. It should be here. should be like right here. Yeah. It's a B-roll of that. That's kind of cool. That oh, be, yeah, that that's awesome. To do at the Hit Factory. See you, too. How's it going, man? This is uh, bar graphic designer Steven oh, and then our video guy, Frank. Wow. some like you know fashion uh, shows and like uh, I'm gonna put some panels for NFT art so that's very amazing cool. and that's my studio yeah it's moving really on cool. up man these are great let me look at this see I love this this is what I love yeah it's expressionist like, like, yeah like yeah where like every person can find something different in it right. yeah you can relate this yeah yeah I love this so cool I can stay here for hours yeah me too very very cool how much is this one here so this is what I was talking about for the uh, in the living room there. Oh, remember I was saying a big piece, the pop of color or something dude. like that over the shelf. Yep, dude, that's perfect. Yeah. It's nice and big too. That's right. Which one's your favorite? I'm just curious. Oh. Like the, your favorite one you've ever done? I really yeah. like this piece. That is, I really like that piece too. Like this is like a five different pieces behind, and this piece very symbolic for me because when I was going through my journey you know I was like a very struggling and like I yeah I, I used to have my like a savings from my previous business but I was supporting myself and my my ex-girlfriend mm -hmm. was like she was also artist and we was you know like a fighting and nobody like buying our art and everything it was like a hard like, this is the struggle right here that's a struggle right there and there's so many like layers behind because we that. was repainting this we could not afford to buy new canvas to create new canvas so we have to like uh, select which piece we're gonna repaint to to, to try to, again to, to try again exactly and like you get the coolest <laughs> yeah there is so many layers right there so this is one of my favorite one for sure it's cost right now 11,000 11 my favorite number okay and like yeah this is my mantra I believe in myself I have the power to create my destiny I am limitless I'm the universe I do what I love and I love what I do so this is my iconic one um, I like that one a lot I love this one yeah so this is for sale yes yeah I might yes. get that one. skulls represent like a like you know what is represent is death, right? Mm -hmm. So do what you love, don't waste your time, and like life is too short to waste it. Right? So that's why I have a lot of skulls in my in my collection. So this piece is called treated. Uh, it's uh, it's made from butterflies, and butterflies represent transformation. No way. Yeah. So like yeah, yeah. Look. What? Yeah. You can see them. That's wow. insane. That's amazing with the texture you did with it. Thank you. That's really cool. Um, yeah. How, how long would it take you to do a piece like this? It's not about time, man. I'm working until it's done, you know? Mm -hmm. Some pieces are done like for a couple of years, some pieces like for months. Like it depends how many energy, how much time and passion you're working on. Like mm -hmm. you, you can like do one stroke yeah. and then leave for a month or you can like dedicate 24 seven and non stop until you finish. So it's hard to tell. I like that. I do too. I mean, this is, that's why, that's why I'm so glad we came over here. You have so much good stuff. Great, man. Yeah, I do the jackets, you know, I do like, you know, custom pieces. Also a lot of neon, a lot of colors, a lot of layers. Also mantras, butterflies. There is one butterfly hidden here. There is a mantras right there. Oh, there is. Yeah, there is a, like a bitcoin somewhere. Also, I <laughs> like kind of the. This is the physical object, and yeah, I do have like a skull like with gold. This one, I guess, in the in the conference mm -hmm. right now, gold with the dual to love. But each skull will be the same rotation the same shape the same everything just different material texture materials reflection mm -hmm. and different backgrounds so mm -hmm. 10 different pieces on top uh, i mean 10 different uh skulls on top of the 10 different backgrounds that represent my artworks and it's That's gonna cool. be like a collection skull collection i like it yeah. and i resonate so much with yeah. like do what you love and follow your passion you know like that's, that's, so that's what i'm, I'm so all about happy. now i just gotta figure out which one i think it's with I think I'm leaning towards, and you take crypto as payment? 
Of course. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've been this just making is, sure. This is the best way to, to like to support. For me, it's like it's exchange energy. Exactly. You know, it's not about like I create stuff to to inspire other people and and just remind them and just you know to appreciate their work because what you do i don't know how you made your money for mm -hmm. example but whatever you do it was your passion it was you was doing what you love and yeah. the universe supported you and it like you know just bring you opportunities right people you were smart enough you was intuition enough you know to to make the right moves all right well i think Take this I think people. it's that. This one. is your piece. Yeah, I think it sure. is. It's the first yes. one I walked up to. And also, this painting also one of the early stages. So it's like it has so much history. I'm gonna share with you the back stage of the creation of this piece. I yes. have like you know everything. Each piece has like a hundreds of photos and videos, all layers. Oh, all no way. You will be amazed when you see like it in the beginning how it started right. and how it looks like right now. So let's get it. Yes. Boom. Boom. Amazing. And then uh, how do you, sh do you ship it or? I can ship it to okay, you. Okay, because I'm in Atlanta. Absolutely. No okay. worries. That's cool. I'm really excited. Cool. Awesome. Yes. Appreciate it. Thank you. All right. Thank you. I'm not sure how all that's going to work yet. Um, I don't know. Is DJ in here? No, nah, he's up at the room. What's he doing? Does Hang he on. even care about me? <laughs> Must be taking a nap. He's signing autographs? I, even look at Bitcoin. Just with what Bitcoin is on. What, what has it done? 25x this year? At the peak, probably almost 25x, right? Is that about right? What's 25 times 500,000? If you can't do that math, you can't make the money. I'm just kidding. Um, I mean, what is that? Like 12 and a half million dollars? You know? Is that exactly right? Dang it! You don't like in and out? No, I do not like it. I still wouldn't say that it's the same as McDonald's. It might be a, a slightly different floor, but it's the same one. Donut, man, nice to meet you. Oh, you're in first class, man. I gotta get to go back to your room. You have enough money, you can buy everything. <laughs> Me, yeah, really? nice to meet you, man. It's like pretty, pretty funny, man. So bad you can't stay away from the fans, huh? Nah, man, got very nice again on the plane. We're going out the same way we came in. Gucci, Gucci shades, Gucci gang, Gucci gang. Had a great trip. It was uh, a lot of fun. Met a lot of really cool people. We actually talked to more people in the airport here. So uh, everywhere we go, TJ's the main attraction. But it's nice to know that uh, sometimes they want to talk to me too. So I'm looking forward to going to Bitcoin 2021 back down here in Miami here pretty soon. And, uh, you know, I, what was your overall thoughts of that? I thought it was a great conference overall. It was good for us to get, it was just fun to get out, interact with people good again. Test run. Yeah, good test run, you know, get back in the conference mode, get the equipment together. So excited to come back, but also ready to go back home and grind again. Building closes next week. So yep. progress keeps ticking. Yep. Can't wait to go home with TJ and grind. I'm real excited about it. Grind, buddy. Oh, look at that grind. That, that's, that's Almost like that. <laughs>